Hey, it's Risa G coming in from her cluttered kitchen for another Tip Tuesday. Um, it's going to be Valentine's Day in a day or so, and I thought I'd give you a great tip on how to, to um, pro I guess, protect, extend the life of your berries. Um, some people like to dip them in chocolate. Just saying. And um, at the moment, they are pretty reasonably priced. And uh, I've seen them cheat on cheap, cheap um, at my store at uh, ShopRite. So I thought I'd give you a great tip on how to preserve strawberries. I've done this a couple of times, but I haven't done it in a while. I don't <laughs> do it all the time. Um, and I just, it reminded me, because I saw it on uh, Rachel Ray, and um, I've done this before, and I don't know why I don't do it all the time. Okay? Um, you buy your strawberries. Let's say they're really beautiful. They're nice and fresh. They're gorgeous. Right? Uh, we have really pretty ripe strawberries. Ripe strawberries. Nothing like them, right? Um, and you want that. Let's say you buy them a few days before, but you don't have a chance. You don't want to. You know you're not going to be able to use them for a few days. Okay? You take one part vinegar. For me, that was one cup of vinegar mm -hmm. to three parts water. In this instance, three cups, right? One cup to three cups. Um, you put your berries in a colander and you soak them, I don't know, a minute. Not very long, okay? And then you strain them out, okay? Right? You strain them out and you dry them off. Right? You don't have to rinse them, okay? They don't really, they don't smell of vinegar. They don't taste of vinegar. They don't smell of vinegar. Okay. All right. And then you just dry them off. Okay. Dry them in your paper towels. Okay. And then, if you saw what my uh, tips a couple of, I don't know, a few months ago. I think it was around this time, actually, around February. Um, you saw how I preserve fruit, right? I use these Debbie Myers green boxes. For strawberries, I put them stem down. In the bigger boxes, there's a, a deeper box. I not only put them stem down, but then I take the tips and I put them in between, all right? And this actually, if you keep it closed and keep it in a cold place, in the refrigerator, in your coldest spot in the refrigerator. It keeps them for a good couple of weeks, okay? All right, so there you go. This will last a good couple of weeks, with or without a green box. Um, so one part vinegar to three parts water. So for me, that was one cup of water, one cup of vinegar to three cups of water, and you just let it soak a minute, okay? And for some reason, the vinegar preserves it a little bit, you know, for a week or two until you can get to them and use them. So I hope that uh, you found that useful and helpful because um, I think it's a great tip. It really is a very helpful tip for preserving the freshness of any berry, not just strawberries. Um, if you like the video, please press like, subscribe to my channel, and uh, press the little bell. And we'll see you again soon in Reese's Cluttered Kitchen. Bye!